Captain John F. Manning, Jr. And shortly thereafter that, I got orders to uh, VF-101 as a flight instructor and an LSO. And in both those first two deployments, I was I trained as an LSO, and I was our squadron LSO and by the time I left, and I was a team leader and all that kind of stuff. But uh, So I went to the RAG to be an LSO and a flight instructor. And the RAG is where I first met Bud Docker. You know, he, he actually uh, was my instructor for the radar intercept phase, and, uh, and then that's where we first met. And uh, I was in the RAG. Uh, probably worked a half a dozen CQ classes for students and, and department heads going back and COs, they all had to come back, go through uh, CQ training. And I was there about uh, nine months maybe, and I got a call from a squadron mate who was up in the Bureau of Naval Personnel and it said they wanted to send me to PG school, and uh, which is, it was complete out of the blue. but. Long story short, after consulting, you know, the COs and some things, uh, I said, okay, I'll go to PG school. And, uh, <clears throat> and they were looking to send aviators there because uh, a lot of aviators couldn't go during the, the early build-up of the Vietnam War because they, didn't, they couldn't spare them. So I went, and uh, we got out there, and, uh, uh, you know, I was behind the power curve in academics, you know, but... Uh, after a lot of hard work uh, caught up and uh, we were, uh, I was about, oh, about halfway through the master's program in aero engineering and uh, I got selected to stay for another year for, uh, they, had, they had four programs there, they had the basic masters, they had an engineer's degree which is more technical, they had a dual masters, a masters in management, and then they had for a select few people, a PhD program. Well, I ended up getting in the dual master's program, and uh, but somewhere a few month, a couple three months later, I ended up going down to Miramar for a change of command ceremony, and uh, I saw airplanes flying again and smelled JP butt burning, and I went back to PG school and said, I want to leave after I get the master's degree, and so I went. I went back to the fleet after that, and, uh, and I left there in uh, December of 73, I recall, and I had orders to uh, the next two F-14 squadrons, 